What you see is a proposed correction to the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear reactor in isolating it from the ocean so that it can cause no further harm. And what you're looking at is a proposed uh, seawall extensions. And this seawall basically, it's about 500 feet from the tip of this right here. It's about 500 feet from here to there. So they would need to bring in a barge and close this off. And if you go over here to this part, this wall would need to be about 700 feet. You know, they can make it shorter or longer depending on how much water they need and depending on what the tide is. This could, you know, it could extend out depending on their water co cooling capacity that they need. They can just extend this and adjust for that. But on my design, I've got 700 feet or about 1,000 feet here, and then this goes off about 500 feet as well. And then the other uh, modification would be to knock this down right here, and there might be some electrical, some type of uh, things that you can't remove from here, so I'd probably be, be, need to be very careful. And here's what's the problem. Um, these workers in here that are experts on this plant, if they're getting exposure to radiation, they're not going to be around in another couple of weeks. So if they have expertise and the types of things that are running down in, into this berm, they need to be able to give that information, and this thing could be taken out to allow this water to flow through. And in, in, a, in essence, what will happen is you'll have the exiting water come through here and recirculate. It'll be a recycling of its own water, and that will, that will prevent any further contaminants going into the ocean. And that's basically it. It's very simple. 500 feet here. About 700 feet, 1,000 feet there, adjustable to, depending on how much water they'd like to have, and then it closes itself off here. And this, I think this could all be done on barges, and they've got a nice big barge they could use that I just saw on the news, and that's all I got. Took me two minutes and 30 seconds to explain this. Um, I believe it's very functional, and I'm looking forward to getting a response from someone, and thank you for watching.